Hello my pinkies and welcome back to another video. I hope you all had a great weekend. And let's just jump into this video. So we are using a kit from Wonderland Planners. I had this kit for a while. You know me hoarding kits and I'm like, oh my god, it's the last week of fall. And because next week I want to use my Christmas and holiday theme kits because we only have, well, you could count last week or this week that I'm doing as a fifth week but I decided to do it as a fall because I do have two fall kits and I decided to use this one instead. So as you can see it's Erin Condren Glossy. It's by Wonderland Planner and I think this is her full deluxe kit that I got with everything that you need to do a note waste space planning. This week plan with me video is from the week of Monday November 27th till December 3rd. Let's get started. Because it is an Erin Conjuring kit, I do know that there will be some white spaces that I need to cover up with washi and I already had selected some that fits very well with the color scheme of this kit. This is going to be a no white space spread. Also, I'm going to change it up uh, differently. I'm not going to do scattered by me. I'm going to do sectional, which I usually do the todays and then my full boxes and then my to do's. But this time I'm going to do all my full boxes up at the top and then do my todays and to do's in the middle and at the bottom section. So here I am just filling out the bottom with the washi. That animal print goes very well actually with the design on the sticker because there is also I believe leopard print there too so I'm so happy to use that washi. I also decided to mix the metal colors, the rose gold and the gold because I want to bring some warmth into the metal color so that's why I introduced the rose gold just to warm up the yellow gold. As you can see here I wasn't that happy with the washi at the bottom so I decided to replace that and use the same stripe washi that I use up there just to balance out the top washi. Next I'm going to place all the full boxes at the top. I usually like to spread out the design and color scheme so it doesn't have blocking effects. So I'm just spreading out all the beige and all the patterns out. As you can see it is an Erin Conjuring kit so there's that extra little pit bits, pits, extra little pits that you need to cover because the line will annoy me so what I'm going to do is just going to cover it with washi tape. I am also going to layer it with the washi tape I used from the bottom that I didn't use so I'm just going to reuse it up here so I don't waste my washi. And then finish it with a line washi but this one is a rose gold. The one it's a little bit different than the top one because the top one is a gold one. Now for my today's section. She does her kit does come with headers so I'm just going to use the today's um, header. I usually do it from Monday to Friday because I want to leave my weekends not to do anything. And then I'm going to put the heart check at the bottom because my bottom section is my to-do list. So there's that little gap above the daily task header. I'm just going to cover that with um, one of my washi tape. Now that I have all my bases done, I'm going to start putting down my meal plan sticker so I don't forget about that. Her kits does come with a lot of, um, I guess, events or appointments stickers. So I'm just going to go through them and see what I need and just build them on top of my meal plan stickers there. Because I wanted this kit, this kit, this week spread to be a no white space spread and her half boxes are rounded corners. I'm just going to use some washi to put at the top and the bottom so that the rounded corners are covered or that the background white is not showing through. The main goal for this week is to get all my Black Friday orders out. So I didn't really schedule much to do except to get them all out. Well, 
What's left is now the weekend bottom section. I thought I could get creative using the Erin Condren bottom washi to fill those two up. But as you can see here, I'm measuring it and there it's not um, wide enough. It's too narrow. So I'm gonna go into my scrapbook stash and see what I could find that will match this kit. As you can see, I found a few things. Well, just three. Sorry, I meant two. Oh gosh, I can't count today. <laughs> I've already cut them into strip and square and I'm just gonna place this down with double-sided tape and I am going to do the same with the sidebar. And I took them off camera to get them cut. Next is the weekend banner and then the top left-hand corner of the sidebar. Is there a, a, a name or plan a name for that section there? Like. I feel like there should be because I feel like we always put some kind of decoration up at that corner. If you guys do know the term, just let me know and comment down below because I don't know what else to call that corner. The theme corner, the main corner, the, the decorative corner, <laughs> I don't know. And on to my weekends. And it's going to be a busy weekend because traditionally we always put up the tree and decorate the house on the first of every December weekend. Before I ink anything, I'm going to start putting down all my functional icon stickers. As I've said earlier that this whole week is all about me fulfilling Black Friday orders so I thought this was a pretty fitting sticker to put down. It says work hard because I do want to get all the orders out by end of this week and have it cleared for the new month of December. And now to fill in everything. And now to put it back into my planner. I also want to show you guys what's um, left over, what I haven't used with this kit, and there's a lot. So obviously I used up all the full boxes, but these are the half boxes, quarter boxes, um, scallop boxes, and these are all your functionals, and your headers, and your activities, and dailies, and I have like three heart check boxes left. The washies, as you can see here, I haven't really used much, and this is all your functional page flags, flags, flag check box so yeah there's like a lot of sticker left uh, even after a uh, no white space spread so it's definitely worth the kit for sure I'll have her shop info and link down below in the description box if you guys are interested head on over and grab a look and that's it my pinkies thank you again for watching I know this is a very short video compared to my other plan with me I felt the last one was just me chattering because I haven't spoke to you guys for a while so for my next plan with me video, I think I'm going to do a talk through and see how that goes because I do need to practice that. But anyways, thank you guys again for watching and I will see you in my next video. Happy planning. Bye.